Hello and welcome guys, Srikanth here back with another video. So this video is a tutorial on how to add Samsung's famous edge feature on any of the Android smartphones. So the steps would be in the description for you guys to follow and the APK would be there. It's a Google Drive link. You could go and download the APK to get started. So without wasting time, let's go. After you install the app there, you will see an application called Edge Screen. The icon would be present there. After going inside, you will see my apps and my people, where you add your contact and the applications. Underneath that, you would get another option saying it screen the settings. So that's one of the important things which you have. Here you will be having opacity and size to make sure that the edge screen bar is not visible in the uh, display if you want it or not. And the next thing is the size. Size matters. Like if you are having a small hands, then you would be needing the size of the edge screen to be at the maximum so that you could access it from that particular limit which it sets. And next is the edge screen side which you want it to appear in the right side or the left side of the display. And next is the position where you could actually just click on it and hold it for a second and you can drag it anywhere at any place you want. So there you have it guys that's the simple setting feature where you go and have it but there's a simple downside to this that you have to keep it in opacity as low as zero because if you're using the youtube app then that white bar would be appearing there you can't be able to see the video properly if you are not seeing that otherwise click keep the opacity at zero and go for it or if you don't if you're not a youtuber or you don't watch youtube a lot that's good to go after you have done this, you can actually add people or my apps by going to the setting or otherwise you could just drag it from the app side and you can add it over here. Like the same thing I am adding once again another app. The same thing would press in there. As I have added the same a contact it would appear here. I have to add something else like Now the contact is added and you have to do another swipe to get to the apps here you also see the plus buttons where you have the add option for applications i'm adding calculator because i calculate a lot and another app whichever i want like the notepad so guys all these apps are right here so it's simple to access this is what the usp of a edge feature is Samsung literally thank you for that. If you want to access the setting, you don't have to always go to the app drawer and get to the setting app. Instead, you can just swipe it and click on the settings icon over here to directly lead you to that. The next thing is that if you don't want the edge feature to appear, you can click on this green button, making it gray. That means your edge feature is not available right now. You can see it here over here. After turning it on, it goes to green and that means that your edge feature is on. So guys this is that this is so simple i hope this is one of the best features which you can have in your smartphone but guys if you are having a phone which has 4.5 inch screen then you might have to uh drag the or you have to place it in such a way that you get to have the apps all over the screen otherwise it'd be a little bit problem so guys i hope you enjoyed the video the links and the instruction would be in the description as i said before i hope you have enjoyed it give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more videos I upload about technology reviews, facts and many other things that is related to education too. So guys, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Thanks. Have a nice great day.